Hey guys, getting back to some programming content. Um, just took some time off for a little. So today is just a short video about WESTERM. Um, I was looking into NeoVim a lot more. I switched completely from Emacs. And I was thinking about going to NeoVide, which is a NeoVim uh, client. And it's really nice, has nice animations. Um, just wanted to try something new and I came across WESTERM when I was researching it. And I really like some of the colors that uh, WESTERM has, the built-in themes, and I feel like it renders fonts really well. It comes pre-packaged with nerd fonts, so you get all those little glyphs. Um, and I think the default font is fine. Usually I go for Fira code, but uh, I found that the default works perfectly. And the main pull for me was uh, the Lua configuration. I found that most of my favorite programs are configured with uh, with Lua, and I find that the it just makes sense to write software with a compiled language, and then have an API that interfaces with a really nice, small, embeddable language like Lua. Um, you know, awesome window manager, NeoVim, WESTERM. I feel like right now these are the three pieces of software that get the most use uh, in my daily setup. And the main thing is you can just write functions that uh, like make sense. You're not trying to deal with configs, deal with YAML. Um, and in this sense, what I really like is that it just reloads automatically. So if I go here, now I've got a fancy tab bar. I want something a little bit more minimal, I can go back. And in terms of functions, I just wrote a short little function to set the tabs the way that I like them. Um, the tabs before, I think they tried to give a name of the program running and just using it with Tmux, um, with fish running in the background. Sometimes the naming got a bit verbose, but definitely check out WESTERM. Really like it, really configurable, and just uh, the meta behind it I really appreciate, which is compiled fast language. In this uh, context, it's Rust that's interfaced with a real programming language. So you can configure it with functions, loops, modules. Right now I've just got one file, but as I explore the terminal more, you can break it up into multiple files and then include them with something like require file name here, then just pull it in. Um, so yeah, that's Western. Really like it. Uh, I've been doing a lot of NeoVim plugin development, so I'll, I'll get to, uh, to that, I think. Just a little demo of some of the stuff I've been doing that I'll show is using telescope and tree sitter to write tests that test functions. Um, so in this case, it just runs a test, but the main challenge again is just using tree sitter to find the function names, the definitions, and to create your own telescope picker. So that video is coming. Um, and just a overview of how to set up super basic Lua plugins uh, that you can put on GitHub and other people can use. So that's in the works. Thank you guys. Definitely check out Westerm. It's a really great uh, terminal. Can't recommend it enough. All right. Thank you guys.